up guys, Jeff Cavalier, AthleanX.com, an Athlean Express video for you, following up on the concept that we introduced last video of weighted ab work and whether or not it was something that you should pursue. I told you how it had an impact on the visibility of a six pack, especially if you're somebody that's already lean but not really seeing your abs. That being said, don't think that weighted ab work always means taking a weight and moving your body through space and trying to crunch and do all those things, I, some of the things I showed you here, even rope pull downs. A lot of the function of the abs is not just generating flexion and generating motion, but it's actually preventing motion, namely preventing rotation. So there's a great exercise that you can do that works on the anti-rotational function of the core that you can load up and weight. It's using a landmine setup here that we put it into the corner of a room. Again, one at the end of the bar, one loaded end of the bar. And what you do is you get into an athletic stance here, you grab on with two hands, and you're going to kind of swipe this thing right and left as quickly as you can. I'll show you in a second. And you'll see that the idea is not to let everything turn the way it wants to. You want to keep your torso and your abs facing straight ahead so that when this weight comes over, the challenge is to not let it take you with it so your core has to fire and work. And the same thing over here. When it comes over, it wants to take you with the bar. Your core has to fire to prevent that. So, looks like this. Nice and quick. Down to your hip. Down to your hip. You can see the whole time a lot of stuff going on up here, nothing really going on here other than the stability. And yes, it's a weighted ab exercise that you can add to that weighted ab arsenal. Now, one last point. One of the best ways to engage the core is to use your shoulders. See, your shoulders are periphery attachments. Really, there's a proximal joint, but they have to control these peripheral arms. When you do stuff with your arms, you can certainly impact your core. If you want to do a quick test, go take your arm, put it out to the side, have somebody press down on it quickly. You'll notice your core will engage just to prevent that, that uh, tilting over of your body. That's where we have to start understanding that you got to start thinking three dimensions, guys. Don't just start thinking about flexing the abs. Think about all the other things the abs actually do and think about all the other ways that we can engage them and work them by using muscles far away from the area of actually uh, of interest. If you want to start doing that, and do that in every single workout, we put abs in every exercise in the Athletics program. You can find that at theathletics.com, get the Athletics training system and start seeing what it's like to train like an athlete and start putting the core at the core of everything you do. All right guys, if you found this video helpful, leave a thumbs up and a comment below. Whatever else you'd like to see, I'll make sure I address it here in one of our three weekly videos.